Um, one of the videos that I found, I don't know when you graduated, and I don't know when this video was from, which was really interesting. It was published by York College, and they were talking about safety on campus. Mm -hmm. And more specifically, like sexual mm -hmm. assault and a lot of different things that were happening mm -hmm. on campus. Um, as an urban campus, is that something that you ever felt unsafe? Yes. Um, you, you are right. How unsafe is, how unsafe I think is I, I told you in the email that that area in general is not that safe. So, um, yeah, I, you feel it once you walk in, you, you feel it when you walk on campus. It's something you have to be aware of. You are right though. It, it is the most diverse, um, school I've been to and diverse environment, but you do feel, you don't feel safe there unfortunately, but I feel like, uh, that's, that just, that's a, I feel like that's a New York city thing. There have, there were a lot of times where I was approached by people that wanted to harm me. And that's why I had to walk through the cemetery. That's why I had to, um, find a buddy to go home or like walk to, that's why I took the bus instead of the train. Um, yeah, walking around campus or walking outside was not safe. So you would prefer to walk through the cemetery. And I think that was something that really shocked me about your email was you were referring to the cemetery almost happily yeah. with a jubilance that normally doesn't come with a cemetery. Yeah. <laughs> so originally when you when you said that to me, I was thinking like, wow, isn't that scary? Like, but your email was just structured in such a way that it it really kind of seemed like it had this weird juxtaposition of you seemed happy mm -hmm. to go through it. And that explains so much that if it was, you know, that mm -hmm. unsafe that you felt more protected. Yeah. Um, so Gosh. I don't, I don't know if you've looked into it, but the school is surrounded by three cemeteries and there's separate buildings. So, um, sometimes if you wanted to go to another building, you could leave the campus and walk outside, but I wouldn't recommend that. So there was a path where you walked through a cemetery. I mean, there's still gates, but it's, it's like a kind of like the yellow brick road from, um, the wizard of Oz. And you just walk on that path and that takes you to different buildings throughout campus and it's much safer. And there's um, school security on every corner. So it, it, it does feel safer than leaving campus. And once you're there every day, you get used to the cemetery and, you know, sometimes you're in class and you look out the window and it's the cemetery or the cathedral. So you just kind of get used to it. And after a while, it's like, you, you forget that cemeteries are, people think they're creepy or something. But after a while, you're just like, oh, that's how I get to my class. That's how I get to gym. Hmm. Yeah. It's really interesting. Because, yeah, like, I, I was really shocked by your email <laughs> just because it seemed like you were, you were excited to emphasize. And it wasn't like, like, as you explained, that creepy connotation mm -hmm. of, Ugh, the schools by a cemetery it was like oh boy yeah I would go through the cemetery mm -hmm. and it's this great yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, wow. I mean it, it's, it's I was gonna... it was the best time to walk through it in October because that's creepy month because of Halloween but like <laughs> when you're walking through it in the summer or January or when it snows it's it's not the same it's a totally different vibe